when Marion hears the click, she knows she's on the job. When she's in harness, uh, you have to ignore her. Don't Tracy Garbett is visually impaired. Ooh, that's cold. And he uses Marion to help him get around. But some people just see another dog on a leash and will try to pet her, which can be distracting and dangerous. It can be very dangerous if she happened to recognize someone crossing Portage Avenue, that could put us both in danger. Distraction is a common issue for guide dogs like Marion, and people who distract service dogs can be fined up to $10,000. It's one of the reasons why service dogs go through so much training to prepare them for the real world. At MSAR, young dogs learn how to deal with distractions. Hey, idiots. Baby, what are you doing? You can't eat him. Master dog trainer George Leonard teaches them to stay focused. And then we'll have like food on the floor, people trying to call them, um, obstacles they have to go around, things that they have to avoid and focus on the handler instead. The training desensitizes service dogs to distractions so they can focus on the job. William Klippenstein, RRC-TV News.